Pump in the trunk since 1968. It's the Sean Jackson Show. That's that old style South Mississippi yeah, type stuff. Yeah, Barbara done called on over. Huh? Oh man, Earl, you moving to Seattle? What, Earl? Tell me what. Let's do some uh, hot topics. What's everyone talking about? What are you talking about, man? It's hot topics on the Sean Jackson Show. All right. Um, in the news, <laughs> Floyd Mayweather and his ex-girlfriend Chantel Jackson have been at odds le- legally for some time, with Jackson accusing Mayweather domestic of domestic abuse and other claims. Uh, the legendary boxer came back with his own legal counterpunch and filed a lawsuit against Jackson, alleging she stole cash and credit cards to buy lavish gifts for herself. Really? You keep, like, a suitcase full of money in the house, cash. So she really took it, though. No. And he... I don't believe the domestic because he can't hit her. He can go to jail. Okay. His he has his legal weapons. He can't hit nobody. Okay. But let me say this. So I keep <laughs> cash in 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 my yeah. house. She can't take it just because I leave it in my house. <clears throat> well, I'm and I'm arguing the point. So is because you, it's in the house, so she has access to it. So but your money is in this house, right? Yeah. And Give it so, to me. No, you don't live here. Oh, I gotta live here. Brad, yeah. Sean, go get his money. Like because so, it's not taking instance, it. He, I can't call file a. Of playing saying he took my money when he has access to the house. No, that's not true. Mm-mm. Access doesn't, that's the same as stealing. Access doesn't mean you're entitled to. Just because we're in the same house and I got my suitcase full of money and we live together and we, it's still my money. It is. Okay, Otherwise, it would be a, so a suitcase if, I expect to If Sean took your clothes and put them on and wore them without your permission, then stretch them out. What? <laughs> Why you got to do that? <laughs> I'm getting, I get what you said. Yeah, this way I needed to. I found this out personally. Like, for instance, with my brother, he took my car. So I went to the police and said he stole my car. But the police told me he didn't steal the car because he lives in the house and he has access to your keys. Work is calling. Hey, Dion. Hey, Juan. Yeah. So that's why I would say that she can't. He can't say that she stole it because she has access to it. No, access doesn't mean you're entitled. Right, and that's true. She's not entitled to it, right. but she can't. He can't claim and say she stole it either. He can. All, all right. So, the, the, but the outlet says that Mayweather only found out about this um, through by way of mutual friend. Okay. okay. So Mayweather didn't even. So he know. wasn't really missing it. He wasn't right. missing it. He exactly. didn't even know that it was gone because he keeps a lot of cash money on him, like ridiculously large amounts of money. Um, also in the news, Jennifer Hudson's estranged fiance David Otunga was granted temporary custody of their son after the singer previously filed for an order of protection. Hudson and Otunga reached a temporary custody agreement this week, giving the WWE wrestler primary custody of their eight-year-old son, David Jr., since the Oscar-winning actress travels so much for work. Um, so. But, so they gave him 15, no, 10 days. 10 days to get all his stuff out of the house. It's either 10 or 15 days. They've been together all those years, and he has, like, that many days to get everything out. Well, there's there's a say. Uh, Otunga's reps believe that she dropped the order so that she could avoid being grilled in the courtroom about the alleged abuse she endured during the relationship, uh-huh. which the former wrestler has firmly denied. Uh-huh. Uh, the actress claims that she was in fear for her physical and emotional safety of that of her and that of her son. It's funny how he wants to be known as a wrestler instead of as punk. Well, he's as, as what? As punk, punk from he was on I Love, I Love New, York. New York. That's yeah. really where he was known With from. Tiffany. Right. Oh, was he? Yeah. Mm-hmm. But he has a serious uh, acting role in some one mm-hmm. of the own Tito? series with Tyler Perry, and he also is an attorney. He has a he's really an attorney from what is it, Harbor or Princeton? I don't know, but he does have. A, he's an attorney. I'm with Pat. I am so with Pat. With Pat I think she should have stayed with the stayed. janitor that she had met prior to Bobby. She, Bobby. Yeah, he was good yeah. until that money got bigger and then she just wanted to go bigger. Yeah. And the janitor wanted her when she was a big girl. Hey, yeah. Gardenia. You hey, girl cousin. So, um, I lost my train of thought. That's okay. All right. Um, also in the news, Meghan Markle is engaged to Prince Harry, whoop, Harry whoop. effectively bringing a little coffee into the royal family I like that. for the second time. <laughs> a little mocha. A little mocha. I like Actually, it. Actually, a little carpet cappuccino. Mm. She's a little Cap- light skinned. Cappuccino when it goes she's, down. She's light. about Lori's complexion, so a little cappuccino. I can't see. Y'all. I, I appreciate her story. Her. 
She's I, from well, she's not from here. She only went to Northwestern, but her mother she, is definitely a colored woman. Mm-hmm. She's from California. I don't know where she's from. Oh, so I wonder she went to the, Northwestern. What the family reunion is going to be? But that's going to be amazing. They say they don't have a problem with it. We have the no, we don't have the problem. Who has a problem? The British has a problem. Oh, okay, somebody had a problem. There's a racial thing going on over there that because they've been grooming women to be, or to at least be um, in competition to be his wife, and here we go because she's like, she's in the. Lying to be queen one day, but you know, she's be behind Kate, but she behind everybody, yeah. If queen ever dies, it seems like she lives forever. She does live forever, but I think that before Harry could be anything, Harry is the fifth in line, right? Because so. yeah. it's, it's and William it's is the like, kids. Fourth. yeah, because. then his children, William's kids, yeah, mm-hmm. William's kids first. He, um, really? but. Yeah, yeah, William's kids are in line first before, it, it and they ain't stop. Brother, they not stop having them. They no. got a whole bunch of. Like they got pregnant two. Now, right? He's so silly. But she pregnant again. Harry, pregnant Harry will never be king. I like the fact that Meghan Markle's been. She's been divorced. She's three years older. And she than has him. a baby. No, no. Seems like somebody said she had a child. No, she don't have a child. She don't have any children. She was an actress. She's three years older than him. She's been divorced. Her mother's African American. They from. And, um, I want to say Compton or what. I don't know. I it's just like this, I like her story and I like what's happening. Because she's not sure every. It's not like she was bred and breeded for her. Exactly. She for wasn't raised for that. Right. It happened. She had And I like love uh, Harry. I don't know why. He just is. He got swag. Yeah. He always has swag. But I like William. William is handsome. Hey. Yeah. Uh, Cardi B. <laughs> I can't <stop. laughs> Our Bodak Yellow friend, Cardi B, says she's a fan of the whole story. She's a fan of the fact it's just like people. Stuck, still stuck to the tradition of the royal kingdoms and everything that doesn't happen in America. So when Cardi B was asked if she'd perform for their May 2018 wedding reception, Cardi happily said yes. Wait, er? And revealed that she'd do it for free. What? I'll just do it because it's like, oh snap, have you <laughs> have you performed? These are red bottom <laughs> These are blood <laughs> shoes. That's, that's, what, that's what they like. Harry is. Have um, you ever performed for a future king? Can you imagine Queen Elizabeth? Turn uh-uh. it up nope. to Bodak Yellow. Sh- Cardi B ain't coming on till it's way after the-, the queen been put to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna be the hair of her tea and got put to bed. <laughs> it's the fact of Cardi performing walk for in. the royals. It's like, oh. That's crazy. As a busty book. Um, in uh, sexual harassment news, Russell Simmons is stepping ah. down from his companies after being accused of sexual assault by writer Jenny guy? Lumet. No, he's a second. They, they just got a white. What is that? A black guy. What was the other guy the other day? A senator? I don't know. He was a something. There's a lot of politics. Um, and Matt Lauer was fired, fired from NBC oh, on Matt Wednesday, Lauer. which was a shocker. I'm um, I filed a complaint for her inappropriate sexual behavior in the workplace. I tried to call in. But actually, it's been <laughs> said that uh, not many of the people at NBC like Matt Lauer anyway, because he's an asshole. So it, that could be. I don't. I don't know if it's true, or it could be just. Some woman upset, and this is the right time to do it. Matt Lauer, yes. Well, I suppose it's a couple of people now. Oh. Yeah, it was a, an extensive investigation, so it just didn't say, "Hey, some girl walked in the door. Mm-hmm. Now you're fired." It's been like a two month thing going on with them, and then because it was so intense that it, uh, the investigation said it would probably be more women who would come um, behind this one woman who alleged that he did some things to her, and as soon as it broke, they did. They came. And spoke, and then um, it was oh my god, his co-host. It was just hard for her. It was hard for them. Yeah, to speak on the videos on the Facebook page. Yeah, yeah to, just because you work with someone for so many years, you wouldn't, you would think they wouldn't do such things, and then you find out that they did. It's just like because you're more than just a friend. You, it's, it's, it's you're hard. a friend, but then you feel for the women who you have right. done this yeah. to. You're so you're torn between mm-hmm. my friend who I work with, and then. But what know. I do like about him is that at least he did admit to some of it. All of it, he is not one hundred percent true. But of course, a lot of it has been over exaggerated, like with the whole button thing. Like like they often say, a lot of big corporations that have meetings, especially in newsrooms, they do have the button to close the door, to lock the door and all that. It's not like it's closed off. It's still glass. You can still see in. So for them, the, the media just took that part to empty. Like, he pushed the button to close the door to secure me in there or whatever. That wasn't really for that. But he did admit to some of the things. And it's like, okay, at least he acknowledged his wrong. I'm waiting and, on them to get a woman. I'm waiting to see wh- who's the first woman I'm they're going for. to accuse. Exactly. I'm waiting for a woman. Because we come make through. comments, guys. It's com- The comments are getting people in trouble. Stuff we take advantage of. 
Just be like, like you know, I could grow blend real uh, quick. See, uh, that, uh, that uh, kind of stuff. Or I'd be like, them jeans show is... See, you better do it. Yeah, that kind of stuff. So Lisa says she wants to be caught up on, yeah. on the hot topics. Lisa, we talked about uh, Cardi B going to... Do perform, perform for the royal. For, yeah, the royal family. We talked about Meghan Markle's background. We talked about Jennifer uh, Hudson and David coming together. We but talk- what you can do is rewind this when we're done, and it's gonna show. But it. that's gonna be an hour and a half for me. Okay, yeah. Mm-hmm. So yeah, Jennifer and David came to a agreement <coughs> with shared custody for their son. Mm-hmm. Um, what else do we say? And Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather. Oh yeah. yeah. His ex girlfriend stole the money out of his so, house. Yeah, both of them. The girlfriend and him, they saw each other. Yeah. Um, and we just talked about. But she alleges a lot of stuff that kind of t- speaks to his character. Yeah, because right? he's very arrogant. So, yeah. and we just talked about um, Russell Simmons and Matt Lauer in the sexual harassment saga that's going on. And next in the news is a scheduling glitch that allowed American Airlines pilots to take vacation at the same time Damn. has left thousands of flights during the busy holiday season period uh, next month without pilots assigned to them. That's crazy. Um, however, American Airlines said on Friday that it believes it has co- has recovered all of the flights that were potentially affected by a computer glitch and staffing issue and that many worried about the effect on holiday travel. Um, it may be it may be being solved. So. You know what? I just go fly for them. You know? Just do it. I just, just tell them to call me. They offered the pilots. So the pilots all scheduled vacation at the same time because the system let them. And so then American Airlines offered them a 200% increase in their salary to yes. fly on that day. Oh. Come so back. I'm, I'm going to take you. Uh, all of them are going to take you. <laughs> Sorry, little Johnny. I won't be at Christmas this year. I got to make the 200% but this more. Money. Well, Johnny better be glad to get that money. Yes, yeah. sir. I'll be like, bye. The wives is glad. <laughs> hey, Robert Phillips, for tuning in on Facebook Live. I'm trying to see us. I can't see us. Hey, here. Lucretia. Hey, Kristen. It's a delay. Mm. Um, mm. I don't even have that. Also in the news, <laughs> the, the Chuck E. Cheese in ah. Oak- the Chuck E. Cheese in Oak Lawn is finally closed for business. The move comes That's after right. multiple violent incidents and Ooh, the yes. shooting outside the restaurant that last year. Uh, what built itself as a kid-friendly environment with its arcade zones, pizza parties, and <laughs> mouse mascot was too often the scene of fights, arrests. That's sad. You got to close Chuck E. Cheese. Among customers. Baby, I saw, oh, I'm, I've I seen had, the party. The, 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 the fights on these, Facebook. Yes, me too. And it beat the parents fighting each other mm. at Chuck E. Cheese. We yeah, don't be Portillo's. the kids to be the parents. Yeah. We was at Portillo's and we saw like the whole place empty out, sitting in the parking, I mean, and waiting to order. Uh-huh. You could just see like a hundred people coming out, so you knew it was a big fight. No, I went for my goddaughter when she was little, and a fight broke out in the Chuck E. Cheese. I was like, really? Like, How come Chuck E. don't break it up? Because... <laughs> but that Oakland uh, um, Chuck E. Cheese was a little hood, though. Lisa says it's about time they closed it. Yeah, ah. yeah they should have been closed, honestly. Chuck E. Cheese, that one used to be, uh, well, all of them used to be Showbiz Pizza. Yeah, that yeah was they did. Showbiz my first time going. That where was a where kid I went. can be a kid? Yes. No, that's Toys R Us. Hey, LaCrystia. Oh. Hey, Christian. Um, so, Toys R Us is where a kid Showbiz can be Pizza yes. was the bear. They yeah. had Billy Bob. Billy Bob the yeah. bear. It was yes. the whole band. Justin yeah. used to be scared of Billy Bob. The Bob, yeah. <laughs> Billy Bob Band. All right, and closing out hot topics in the news, uh, North Korea broke a two-month lull in weapons testing with the dramatic launch of its most advanced missile yet, an intercontinental ballistic missile it claims can reach the whole United States mainland. Uh, North Korea's latest test in September set off a firestorm of condemnation in the region and beyond with multiple warnings from the United States president, including one issued during his stop in South Korea where he implored North Korea do not try us so they just shot off another missile that said that they could reach um, Chicago in 35 minutes and New York in 38 minutes don't come yet well it's possible just letting you know the possibility All right. anything else in the news well yeah they was talking about the president and the, the man what was that man we was talking about the one who uh, agreed to fully cooperate oh. with the FBI, and he and he also admitted that he lied to the FBI. He admitted that General the, somebody, yeah, his uh, that him. That he also admitted to lying about Donald sending him to go make contact mm-hmm. with the Russians when he was still running for president. Right. 
And so, you know, Joy at the time. Mike Flynn. Antonio Walls yeah, said Mike Flynn. Mike Flynn. That's him. Joy Antonio Walls. Because it was breaking news Friday. <laughs> Where did he get on? What is happening with the people? He, he said, hey. Hey, Antonio hey. Walls. I don't know him. So, it was breaking news yesterday on Friday. And it was during the middle of the views uh, on air. And they gave it to Joy. And she ran with it, honey. So Trump um, <laughs> says that he knew that General Flynn f- lied to uh, the FBI. Come on. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's what's going on in there. I, I haven't really followed the story. Antonio Walls would probably be best to, next time he come in, he can tell us what's happening. He can I'm call him, 773-340-3609, and he can participate. Yeah, Antonio, call in in about... Five minutes after I turned the yeah, phone line basically on. what I basically <laughs> got was Donald fired him or whatever and then the man who was leading the investigation against the <laughs> Yes, Lisa, House. their Christmas decorations. <laughs> <laughs> and while I say the son-in-law is next. Yes. They say Jared he, Kushner. The son-in-law is going to take the heat for a lot of this. Which is they are. Um, uh, the daughter's husband? Yes. yes. Okay. So, again, now coming off of that, but still on some of the same, is the okay. tax bill about to be passed? Well, the Senate, the, uh, the Republican, yeah, they got, they got their vote. They won. So, I don't, know, I don't know much about the tax bill, but it did pass. It passed today. Um, so, what they're saying is, what I saw on the news is the people who make 75000 or less will be hit with more taxes, and the people between the seventy-five and over $100,000 will get a cut, get a break, a tax break. He, uh, I'm saying it doesn't make sense. How long is this man in office? How long are we going to be pumped? It's only been a year. We got three months. No, I don't think it's going to last, though. I'm ready I for think him he's too. finally going to get impeached. I do. Well, I don't think he's going to get impeached. I'm like Joy Behar, who thinks he's just going to resign. Yeah, yeah he's going to resign. I don't resign. think he's ever going to resign. So many dominoes are going to fall. He's mm-hmm. going to resign. Have no choice I don't see him ever resigning. But in Chicago news, the soda tax is, in local news, the soda tax is over. The soda tax ended today. Yeah. Yesterday. yesterday. So I can go get some Pepsi now. You sure get some Pepsi. Yeah. Yes, and you don't have to pay the uh, penny per ounce. I'm talking about in Indiana because y'all yeah, keep telling everybody was talking about. It. <laughs> <laughs> Come on now. We yeah. still got to pay for bags, so we still be in Indiana. But um, wow. Also in Chicago news, the snow route parking ban has started, Sorry. so watch yeah. your signs. If you're on a snow route, watch the signs because it's most likely uh, you'll have to move your car whether it's snow on the ground or exactly. not. So uh, watch out for that. Also, too, in Chicago news, Lori no more, maybe no more about because she Who's is a Lori? CPS. Um, employee, mm-hmm. but they talking about um, closing some high schools, which is Robeson is one, and Harper, Harper, and oh, John no, Hope. closing Robeson. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Shalon, they're closing your school. Right, I don't know Shalon if you paid attention. Yes. but Robeson is going bye bye. But see, they're putting a new school on the side of Robeson anyway. That's right. going to combine. So they closing schools. those schools and put a state of the art new mm-hmm. high school. Not until twenty eighteen. Yeah. But it's more so I think it's to attract more kids to come from all over. Because <laughs> if you think about those particular schools, besides Hope, but Robinson and Harper are not schools kids would travel from different areas to come to. So a lot of those kids that go to those schools are from their neighborhood who probably wasn't able to get into any other high school and they had no choice but to go to that school. Or they just were like, okay, I didn't apply. To Let school. the kids go where they want to go. Yeah. But I can't you know, stand this. But that's how it is. Yeah, well, it shouldn't be. But okay, Wall says uh, he's going to be impeached soon, Mister Forty. See, Wall, I'm with you. And Lisa said thanks for the tip, uh, Sean, on that parking stop. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, definitely. And, and then Pat says that there was some angry white folks on TV last night. Ooh, that was so mad, mad about that parking mad. ban, the snow route. The because, oh, yeah, because a lot of people got told. The guy said his alarm went off. He ran outside, and the man said, "I can't let it down." It drove off. Yeah, because once they pick it up, you can't let it go. Ooh, he was so mad. <laughs> so you have to get to the car while they hooking it up. But once they was his hook. How so, about just don't park there? How about pay attention to your sign? Yes, that's the issue. Well, if you moved into an area. That you may not know about, yes, then, yes. you know, but and then and don't watch the news as yes, often. Yes. And it's usually on Main Street stuff. No, yes, okay. yes. <laughs> Man, that was a lot of hot topics. Lisa, right is there anything you want us to talk about? Any any hot topics you you want to share, Lisa? Lisa posted it in the uh, in the in the message there, and we will talk about it. I'm looking to see. If anything breaking has happened in the Chicago area since we've been on. Now, we talked about Chicago public schools. There were some parents very, very upset. At Mollison? Oh, uh, yes. for the Because um, they wanted to do the walkthrough to see the... At Mollison. Yeah, at Mollison Elementary over here on the east side. 
What is my, what happened? So the school um, had the local school council had reported that they had uh, needed to be exterminated. The school had like. If that's uh, pet, if not pets, called? they were pets. I mean, I mean, you know, a pet is a dog, and okay, a cat. so it was like rat droppings and urine and stuff like that. So they called for an extermination, right? But the one the locals, they all the parents wanted to do the walkthrough or something, and they wanted to let everybody in. Yeah, it was a big uh, issue that there was rat infestations, That's and they saw the drop droppings and everything, and it was they did see poison. And the, the people representing the school, you know, they talked about how they're cleaning it up and getting it. And I think they stayed in the school for like two o'clock in the morning just because they had one area that they still needed to clean up, but they wasn't letting the parents in. And it was a, a sight to see on the news how they were holding them back while they were trying to let somebody in. So, and the yeah. other lady trying to push the man out the way and she fell. Like, girl, go sit down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lisa, we are excited about the royal wedding and Cardi B ain't going to be able to. Oh, yeah, we talked about, yeah, yeah we Cardi- are we excited about that too, Lisa. But they I'm say Mariah really Carey excited. may be able to. Mar- girl, Mariah Carey can't even stand up. Well, she just got that cert. Didn't uh, we talk about she lost some weight yeah. last week? Uh, yes, she had uh, the show that we didn't air. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, Pat said uh, another hot topic is high ass rent in Chicago and buildings more and more becoming corporate owned. I agree, uh, Pat. I just had to raise the rent for my tenant four hundred dollars. Now it's, it's it, you know it's something the landlords have to do. It's it's a hard pill. To now swallow. they say with the with the beverage tax you know going away. That they're coming more for property taxes now. Yeah, so people are glad that they got to rate, got rid of that penny per ounce, but we're going to get it somewhere. They're going to put it somewhere, and it's going to be higher than that penny per ounce. Love it. I mean, I'm I'm, listen, I'm saying love it because I'm reading um, Lisa. She's just so excited for a biracial woman being in the family. But I think taxes in in Illinois have been going up like it's like every other month. Okay, I'm tired of it. It's crazy. Um, okay. All right, so that's hot topics here on the SJS show. Let's do the inspirational song of the week. Hey, if you got any um, anything you'd like us to talk about on the show, post it in our live feed, and we will talk about it when we come back. It's the SJS show seven seven three three four zero three six zero nine.